Hi everyone. So last week I was telling you about how we were waiting for tassels to emerge in the corn and this week the tassels have emerged in most corn fields. So I just want to show you what now what's happening to these corn plants because it's just amazing how quickly they start to change. So the tassels you can see are starting to emerge here at the top. Nelly said, oof, and the pollen's falling. So here's the tassel. It's not fully out yet, but it is coming. And what's falling off there, that's the pollen. So then this is how pollination happens. So when the tassel emerges, so too does the ear of corn. So here we've got our little bitty ears of corn. Okay, just starting with the silks. These are the silks. Now these are very sticky because they will catch the pollen as they fall. Each one of these silks is connected to one of the kernels that we will eventually see forming on the ear of corn. So there are hundreds of silks attached to those kernels. The pollen falls down, falls to the silks. That's how pollination occurs. Now I want to show you something else though that um, I'm seeing happening. My farmer is not going to like this. So Natalie, come a little closer because we talk a lot about how we uh, will apply pesticides to help with controlling weeds, insects, and diseases. Let me show you the insects we're dealing with right now. So here, if you can get close, see all those little green bugs in there? Look at all those little buggers. They're cutting the silks. You see this right here? This, whoops, Oops, Sorry. got that. See this right here? All these silks that are being cut. So those beetles climb in there they cut the silks or they eat the silks, it leaves less silk to catch the pollen and then we get pollination issues. And the problem happens if that pressure gets too great in this field, then, then we're sunk and our pollination will be really bad because of those, those beetles in there. Um, so you'll notice real quick, I wanna show you too then, what we want on every corn stalk is one ear of corn, but when you're driving down the roadway and you see that first row of corn, you might see like this one right here has two ears of corn forming on it. Okay, we just want one. And the reason why we only, we get two ears of corn on these corn stalks on the edge of the field is because um, there's not any pressure from another row of corn next to it. So if we were to walk into the corn field, follow me come into the corn come into the corn even by one row you'll notice that we have just here we go one ear of corn on the stalk so there's another little fun fact all right that's pollination for corn it won't be too long and we'll be starting to see those ears of corn fill out and then i'll be back and show you more